Some of the high scores for the most mining XP gained in a single day, week, and month is absolutely absurd, with the top of the week being 18.7 million XP gained. But about two months ago, a character under the name of Mains L came along and completely blew that record out of the water with 19.7 million mining experience gained in a single week. And when this high score came along, the high level community was up in arms. They couldn't believe it. They are saying that this is no way a legitimate high score, so it's not currently on the high scores for the weekly XP gained, although they have left him on rank 8 for the most XP gained in a single day, but apparently the max mining XP is 134k an hour, so for this guy to achieve that amount in one single week, he would have to be playing for 21 to 22 hours per day with absolutely no mistakes at all, which is super unrealistic, only sleeping for two hours a day and literally not even taking any toilet breaks or breaks to go eat just literally grinding that many hours per day for seven days straight people are just saying it's far too unrealistic to ever be possible or maybe this guy has a very sneaky method that he doesn't want to share either way that high score and the other ones that people say are legitimate are just super insane no lifing i can't imagine it but still kind of cool to point out how crazy some of these records are. Curtis has started Zora on the farmer's account, but it's only early days. This is his fifth ever KC. Oh, no. <laughs> Yo, oh, no nah. way. Wow. <laughs> Crazy RNG to pull that one out of 3k so early, but it is completely useless for their accounts. Oh, I'm just surprised that people would listen to... <laughs> Bad men had only been hunting that pet for 1,200k C, and he just sat there in silence for quite some time after he got it. Oh, now it's done. We never have to come back here. I just blew my load. Now we know exactly why the man sat there for so long, so silently, just looking extremely happy. Feeling that we're not going to see anything in this one. Well, it turns out that feeling was wrong. When I saw Twisted V, I almost like had a heart attack, but <laughs> I told you guys it was going to be a Twisted Buckler. I told you guys. One of the biggest troll names you can receive, the good old Twisted B. Unfortunately, it wasn't the bow, but while fighting Ohm, he does have a big bag of tricks. He consistently can throw at you and he is no monkey summing it up. He's like, uh, let me see. What do I got in here? Um, uh, Portal's Acid. Well, Meiji, um, uh, acid while setting up four to one. And there you go. Uh, what else we got in here? Uh, heal, 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 heal. Jad hit, Jad hit, heal, Jad hit, heal, Jad, heal, heal, heal. Jad, Jad while you're overloading. Acid, flame wall. I think after sending thousands and thousands of KC, it's about time no monkeys went and touched some grass, and he did exactly that in the DK's lair. Yesterday, I covered the massive D&G boosting server drama. Well, the person who is the new owner was not very happy about that getting shown to the community. I'm going to give him the time of day to show his side of the story, but this is the last thing I'm going to mention on anything of this matter. And personally, I like this comment saying all boosting should be banned. I think the game would be better off without it. But here's the response from Mr. Kobe. Basically, he's stating that a lot of things, if not all the things we were shown on yesterday's video, were fake Discord messages and some were jokes clipped out of context and he said the only rash decision he made was kicking a jmod from the server because that jmod kept on nerfing their boosting methods that they were using and stating that he put in a lot of work for the server more than they said and then he asked them if he could take ownership and they didn't want to do that so he kicked them out of the server it's a lot of he said she said i've put it all out there for you to read and make up your own decision but be very careful with whatever boosting service you're using and to be honest most of them are probably just using the gp to real world trade anyway. Well, with all the boosting going on, how could we go past Lake and seeing him get another purple? Alright, at least we're uh, back on the purples somewhat. B2B. Oh man. 
Hey, thank you. Uh, thank you for ulting that raid, by the way, man. We definitely overdid it on getting some of the points back. <laughs> Not a good one for him, but it does seem all the group hardcores had all the RNG today. <gasps> no, I got a pet! No! <laughs> Holy shit! And she did it again! She did it again! And at 555 permits, it's one of the coolest KCs we can see. But don't think their day was finished there because the farmers also had to go to Zami. Let's go! Ooh. Yes, dude! And we can even make it That's right away. That's a full god sword right there. Yeah, let's go. A full god sword. And you might have to look out for videos on their channels to see what else they got from Zami. But wait till you see this clip of good old mammal at LMS. The man had to remember he was getting watched by thousands of viewers and had to act a little bit more normal after his outrageous reaction. I guess some of the farmers were having a great day and some of the farmers were roidy. Don't you keep walking. Don't keep walking. You piece of sh- All right. Everybody, everybody on the Runelight team who made this Sins of the Father quest helper needs to just be systematically lined up on their knees and then have the bottom of the soles of their feet tickled with a feather for the rest of time. BTC is risking an extreme amount, but the person he's versing is trying to run away, but has no run energy left. Please! Or does he? Bro, who does that, bro? You're so weird. You're so weird, bro. I just lost 500 mil. So weird for faking that, bro. Now, I respect that, PK. The man was slowly walking away. Then the big RKO, watch out, bang, taking 500 mil. If it wasn't enough, Soy Juro has just been raided with 33 viewers, but check out this call. Ain't no me, bro. Yo, Sam, appreciate that. Turn me up. About to get this call right here for the Sam raid. It's insane, the RNG. Oh my God, it actually happened. What? 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 And we better state that that was also on a hardcore Iron Man. Now, Curtis had on push to speak, but as he left, Denise thought he was still there. Do we have any uh, anti fires? Ooh. My husband is ignoring me. Apparently, she's still asking him for those anti-fires to this day. Dr. Cruz is close to finishing off Skatizho, but he decides to make a little bet with his buddy in the Discord. You said yes? Dude, you're being so scared. It's almost dead. Dude, it's like, it's like you have, like, insider information. I don't, dude. You're gonna only fucking yeah, I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. He made the call. If he receives the pet here, his friend will owe him 50 big ones. That thing's gonna be following me. Oh my god, no way! No! <laughs> and can you believe he actually got it? But please be careful playing those games. Technically, that could be classified as playing games of chance for GP. And I'm sure it's not what Jagex meant by that game, but they could be crossing the line very slightly. Donator had just 5 HP and a dream. I'm not sure if it's just me, but that sounded exactly like Elmo. Suzetsu Juan was doing some Zami, and he's getting close to that pet drop rate. Intentionally lose a tick at the Andre Taint tile. <gasps> no f way. Yo, holy. Ah, let's get the f out. Yo, Krill is done. 33 pets is a whole bunch, but George also had a whole bunch of his buddies here to try and kill this PVMA, but the PVMA decided to fight back and was not afraid to skull. Smite's up, guys. There he is. He's coming out. He's coming out. Oh my god, tell me someone got the TB. I don't think they did. Bro, he just made it so he, he can't escape. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out! Oh my god, of course I TB. Bro, the double AGS was beautiful. What? Bro! Oh my god! I just got 40 mil! The biggest PK of George's life. That guy didn't get smarter because he actually had a Missouri top on which he kept. That would have given George the biggest surprise of his life, but he was over the moon with that nice 40 mil with the web weaver bow. Manta said he was promoting this channel the entire stream, saying get B he to 100k. Maybe that's why he got this drop. <gasps> we got it! Oh my god! Oh! Yes! Oh, look at the little devil! Ah! And if 
you would also like to help get the channel to the big 100,000, please drop a sub.